Nearly 24 hours of tennis played throughout the fortnight, John. Uh, we talk about the city that never sleeps. Carlos Alcaraz didn't get a lot of winks during the two weeks of the U.S. Open. What impressed you the most with what he was able to do over these seven matches? I, I think that's just it. I mean, the, the fatigue just never got from 23 hours and 39 minutes, well, 24 hours on court. That, that's like uh, that's like a full day of tennis. And it just never seemed as though his reserve flagged. I mean, there were there were three five-set matches, which isn't just a lot of time on court, but it's a lot of emotional bandwidth. And you just had the feeling he was said, look, I'll go for it. I can take a long siesta when this thing is over, but we're going to figure out a way. And he's talked in press about how he's gotten to sleep when the, the sun's already come up. I mean, he would rehydrate. He would feed himself here. When he played those long matches, he didn't just go back to the hotel and get out of here. He thought about recovery, even if it came at the expense of a few extra hours of sleep. And boy, I mean, I guess some of this is being 19, but some of this is also real professionalism. And you could see when he ran to his crowd, when he ran to his box and he ran to his team, they deserve uh, a big raise as well because I think they really helped him through this fatiguing tournament.